At the Dolly Parton tribute, Grand Ole Opry apologizes to an audience member after El King performed Hammered. The Grand Ole Opry has issued an apology to a concertgoer via social media following El King's contentious performance, in which the Grammy nominee professed to being F. Ing Hammered and acknowledged that she occasionally forgot song lyrics. King, 34, performed on Friday night at the Ryman Auditorium alongside artists. Ashley Monroe, Tiggerly Gold, Daly and Vincent, and Terry Clark in celebration of Dolly Parton's 78th birthday. In multiple videos posted to TikTok, the X's and O's singer was seen arguing back and forth with fans regarding refunds during the Nashville performance. The conversation started when King, 34, appeared to be singing incoherently and then started improvising, saying she didn't know the words to one of Parton's hits, Marry Me, even though it was obvious she was intoxicated. I don't know the lyrics to these things in this F, Ing Town, King crooned. Don't tell Dolly cause it's her birthday. Everyone's like, holy s, we bought tickets to this s, she continued after the song. She put her hands in her pockets and said, I'm not even going to lie. Holy shit, not even an f-ing lie from me. You guys purchase tickets for this s. When the performer informed the audience that they ain't getting your money back, one of the audience members retorted, I don't want it. King chuckled, good, because you ain't getting it. One TikTok user who was at the show claims that before the interaction with the audience, King cursed about 15 times on stage and forgot the words to the Dolly song she was supposed to sing. The location subsequently shut the curtain on her, according to the TikToker. Let me tell you one more thing. Hello, I'm L. King, and I'm F. Ing Hammered, King declared on Friday evening. King's representative has remained silent about the event. One fan claimed that King ruined the night with her horrible, drunk, and profane performance, adding that it was a shame we all had to witness that. The Grand Ole Opry addressed the fans' concerns on X, the former Twitter platform, on Saturday. Hey, Judas, we sincerely apologize and regret the language that was utilized during the second Opry performance last night, the Opry responded in writing.